Hi, I'm Elaine Kazimierczuk and I'm an artist and one of my favourite things to do is to paint wildflower meadows. Here's a couple I've made recently. Look, there's one of a coast on the uh, Channel Island called Alderney. Here's another one. These are oil paintings, but what I'm going to set you to do as a challenge is to make a thing called a collage, which is made by sticking scraps of paper onto a background and you get a really cool effect like this. You can stick lots of flowers on, lots of stalks and grasses to get an effect to make your own wildflower meadow. to prepare the background. Um, this is my meadow. It's a buttercup meadow which is very near where I live. Um, I've printed it but I've also got it up on my laptop and you can uh, use either um, images. If you like to save paper then you can just have an image up there on, on a, a screen. You want to make a strip of blue at the top. This is acrylic paint. You can use any paint you've got, poster paint's fine. This is your sky. As you can see in my picture, there's very little sky showing, it's mostly hedge. So I'm going to add that on as well. And then I've got some of ochre, a bit dark green. You want it to be quite messy. You don't want anything too tidy here because. It's only for the background. I'm going to stick an awful lot of stuff on top of this. And you can add other colours in if you think it fades out into the background. That's all right as well. So scrub away because that gives a kind of um, grassy effect. So cover the whole paper. to dry but whilst it's drying we can go on to make the templates now there's your template um, and you need a piece of cardboard like an old cereal packet uh, and you're going to glue the, um, the template down Um, I've actually put some templates for some stalks and some stems but to be quite honest I think you could probably cut those strips out freehand. There we are. Now that's got to dry thoroughly. Don't try and cut it out until the glue is really dry. Okay and then we'll make some flowers. All right. Right now we're going to make the flowers. I've already cut out some templates here um, so uh, you just simply cut each of those out and make a whole selection of templates and because I'm doing a buttercup meadow I'm going to choose the buttercupy shaped pieces. I won't use all of these for instance there are no daisy type um, flowers in my meadow so I'm not going to use that one uh, but these are all a bit buttercupy. So those are the sort of shapes I want, and that's a kind of buttercup leaf shape. I want lots of leaves and lots of flowers, so those are the sort of shapes that I, I want to use. I'll probably come back and get some more in a minute. Okay. You'll have picked out some nice scraps of paper and other things. Here's that 
foamy stuff again. Um, some plain paper and some patterned pieces out of magazines. So now we're going to choose um, a piece of scrap of paper and I'm going to make lots and lots of these. It doesn't take very long actually. a lot that I've already made. Lots of leaves, lots of buttercup flowers. Keep them in sort of size order if you can when you've made the, uh, the flowers because you're going to put them on in a different order. Um, and some nice, those nice Marilyn Monroe pieces look you can see. The sticky toffee pudding or whatever it was, lemon drizzle cake one. So um, we're ready to start sticking some on I think. I've been getting on with making the collage and as you can see I've glued some flowers in at the top here and lots and lots of stalks and leaves. Um, I cut out some little tiny fiddly bits of um, paper there uh, which aren't on the templates so you can make those yourself if you want to. Um, right so let's see how I'm doing it. I'm building them up from the top corner. Here's a couple of fiddly ones look so that they look, you can see how fiddly this is, like the ones in the picture. Look, there's the, the photo I'm working from. So you've got the tiny ones at the top and then they get larger and larger as they come to the foreground. We're not going to copy that exactly, but we're just using it as an idea. over the front of that. I like the way that these sort of flop a little bit. So there's your collage. Buttercup meadow. There we are. I hope you have fun making one. <laughs>